Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at one of the nicest tag axle diesel pushers that we've ever seen. This is a 2022 American Coach, American Dream Model 42Q. We are gonna take a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about the American Dream and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Again, welcome back to another video. My name is Matt from Matt's RV Reviews. It's World's Only Channel giving you a true unbiased review about everything when it comes to RVs. And again today, I am super excited. We are taking a look at the American Dream. But before I begin, I would like to say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea! Hi everybody! How's it going? It's going good. We are here at RV1 of uh, Fort Myers. Yes! Thank you so much for having us. Yes! And you guys, uh, this is my American Dream. Oh man, I love it. So wait till you see it. It's gorgeous. Uh, it might be one of my new favorites. Yep, there you go. Andrea, we can't we can't just keep having units no. being your new favorites. No, no, no. Uh, I, I, especially I, more expensive units. Matt, this is owned by Rev Group, so uh, I am partial to Rev Group with Fleetwood and Holiday Rambler. Andrea, let's begin. Model is 42Q. The actual tip to tip length of this motorhome is 42 feet, 11 and a half inches, pretty much 43 feet. As Andrea said, this is owned by, this is American Coach, it's owned by Rev Group. So the American Coach, Rev Group is Fleetwood. They end at the Discovery LXE, and American Coach starts at that next price point, that next tier level, okay? Really nice up here, Andre. Look at this front area. Beautiful. We do have a generator right here. Let me get this pulled out. As you can see there, it is wow. a Oman QD 12,500 generator with the slide out tray that is super awesome all you got to do is push a button this does this also sits on the freightliner chassis it's the freightliner liberty chassis i'll explain that on the other side the engine is a 450 horsepower cummins engine 1250 foot pounds of torque and it is the 8.9 liter andrea you know what that is what that's america right oh, that's there that's right that's the american dream that's the oh. American dream, and that's the American dream. Yeah, and then also something that I want to point out, this is all chrome right here, okay? They just have it covered up, you know, before somebody, you know, all these stickers is all chrome. I love the LED light strips and everything, and then it does have the collision mitigation. Also, these nice big, look at these mirrors, Andrea. Oh, yeah, bus style. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Very nice. And then coming on down the side, look at these tires and drain they're michelins i love those 315-80 r 22.5 with the shiny alcoa rims i love that now again this sits on the liberty bridge chassis which is a custom chassis made by american coach and so how american coach gets their chassis from freightliner is it's the modular and then they actually build the bridge on top of this so one when you see the slide out system you don't have the like little keystones like falling out taking the place of the storage also this is going to give you the most uh storage on a diesel pusher you'll see that in just a second frameless windows andrea okay door awning right there also you have the gerard awning right there and then notice down there how they painted that gerard on very nice, nice. frameless windows and then finally look at the slide out system flush slide out it actually goes up and in and then goes out and down very very nice feature. oh no oh no don't worry we got the key on right we're all getting the key look at the step system isn't that nice that's pretty cool yeah let me grab the keys real quick perfect oh there you go Nice. There you go. So look at this. Very nice storage underneath. And we've got a tray or more I tray. Yes, ma'am. Now these are manual trays. Okay. 
when you get to the American Coach Eagle, that's when you start getting those fancy um, automatic ones. Yes. Okay. I love the doors. Yes. And then Ooh, look at that. Oh, we got a cooler. I'm going to pull this one out. So look, this is a little one, you guys, and there's another one down there. But look at that. Nice Dometic cooler. Put your beers in there. Great storage. Yes, ma'am. And then I'll show you, the boat, that's the DEF fill. Uh-huh. And then right over here is TV on the outside. Very nice, Samsung. Yes, and I love how all the trays do slide out. Very, very nice feature. Coming on down the side here. Look at these batteries. That's you got battery eight house bank. batteries. And there, yep, there is a battery disconnect right there. Also notice how it's heated. Um, it just makes it better. Battery control center and everything. Converter. Yep. Surge guard Start. protector. Everything that you're gonna need. And then right here, Andrea, I call this an any tire and an Audi tire. Now when you see the Audi tire, that means it has the ultra steer. So what that does is when you're going less than 20 miles an hour and you're cutting the tire real hard, this ultra steer will turn this tire, making it a better turning radius, which is needed for these big diesel pushers. Very nice feature there. And then here's some of your chassis batteries and everything else. Okay. And then coming around the back, we do have a nice fiberglass rear cap. Again, diesel pusher, this is where your engine is. 15,000 pound hitch. This motorhome can tow 15,000 pounds. Now something to know that, okay. So the max tongue weight is 1,500 pounds. And it does say with weight distribution bars, you can tow 16,000 pounds. I would never max something out, you know what I'm saying? If you could tow 15,000 pounds, I would say tow 10,000. If you need to tow 15,000 pounds, get the bigger one that can tow 20,000. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Just just that way. Be, just be safe. Exactly. And then we got a backup camera up there. Yep. This unit does have the side mount radiator, which we'll show you in a second. Also, there's a ladder to get up on the roof. Andrea. Not my favorite ladders, Not Matt. mine either. But let's go up there and take a look. Hold on. Here we go now. Up here on the roof, you can see it's a nice one-piece fiberglass roof. Not one, not two, but three Whisper Quiet air conditioning units. I love that. You have your King Air digital antenna, three Max Air fan covers, uh, Wi-Fi Ranger up there, and then you do have solar already on the roof. All right, Matt, please be careful. Here we go now. Hold on. All right, two steps. Oh, great. And if you haven't already, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. What the RV salesman's gonna take his fat ass up on the roof? Show you what features the roof has to offer. Take his what up? No, there's customers. Uh, <laughs> Nobody. Nobody. Perfect. And then finishing up, Andre, again, side mount radiator. The reason why these are better than the rear mounts is because the airflow that's going in while you're driving, it's because it's coming in from the side. You don't have those wind forces coming in from the rear. Right here, this door is an emergency exit door from the rear, um, from the rear bathroom. Right here, it's gonna be your fresh water fill, your potable water, potable, potable. And then coming on down the side here. Ooh. Look at this, your wet bay, uh, black and gray tank dump station, very nice water filtration. Your water hose is on a reel, which is nice. And then check this out. This does have the hydronic heating system from Aquahot. It's a 450D. What this means, Andrea, there's no propane on this motorhome. It's all electric. This is the diesel heater that will help heat the motorhome, heat the towel floors and everything. And if somebody wants to know all the specs about this motorhome, bing, here's where all the specifications are. And Andrea, there's even a Dirt Devil vacuum system. I know. It's already ready for me. It's ready. And then right here, you can see that it does have a 50 amp power cord with the reel. Nice. Yes, ma'am. 
other Other side side. of that storage. Yes, ma'am. See that tray. And then, yes, there's a two-part tray. So that one part had the refrigerator, and now you have the other one. That's nice. Awesome. And then this was one full long tray. Okay. Well, Andrea, oh, we didn't even mention. In the mirrors right there, there was side cameras. You see it right there? Oh, yeah. Yes. Well, Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but the inside does look even better. Let's go take a look. Walk on in. Get the cargo. Okay. Oh, 5,276 so pounds. Wow. All right, guys. Look at this. Slides are in. There's opposing slides here. There is a little bit of a walkway, but you know, you just turn to the side, it's doable. Gets better right here. Beautiful, oh my goodness. Okay, more room here. And it is very tight to get into the half bath. You can see that right there. And then there is the master, which has a tilt -a bed and then you can see the master bath back there. Very pretty. Really, really, really liking the colors in here. Okay. No, Andrea. Watch this slide out. Look at the floor right there. Okay. And then watch it dip down. Now check the other side. I didn't put the other side all the way out. Is the chairs gonna affect the floor? Um, maybe. I'm just gonna move them real quick. Oh, hang on, hey, watch your toes. Okay, there we go. Okay. It's okay. Very good. And then Andrea, we're gonna get started with the front cockpit area. Okay. Come on up here. Super, super nice. Look at this. I'm a commander. This is the American dream right here. You have your auto leveling right here, your cup holders, your tag dump. Look at this, you Ooh, have a power window. That's so cool. Yeah, so you can go get your Mickey D's right here. I love that. Don't take this in a Mickey D's. <laughs> but still, that, that's good for when you're checking into campgrounds and everything. Power shades, radio, you got your backup camera. You can see your left side, right side, and reverse side. It is super nice. Digital dash right here. Again, 450 horsepower. This is also a telescoping steering wheel. Okay, very nice. Does it have an air horn? <laughs> oh man, American dream! <laughs> it does have the air horn, Andrea. Yeah. And then sit in that passenger seat. You don't have to tell me twice. Sit in oh. that passenger seat. Told you twice. Beautiful. You know what, you guys? I just love the colors up here. Yes. The seat is really comfortable. Yes. There is a footrest here. Good. As you can there is a step cover here, you guys, that uh, you could put over when you're driving. I love it. I love it. Let it go all the way. Oh, look at that. Nice. You see how it went over yep. then up? Yep. It's very, it's flush. So nice. Okay. I do see that we have some cabinets in here. Yes. So right over here is where I was pushing the buttons for the hydraulic uh, room slide outs. Over here, just that. A little bit of that stuff, Wi-Fi Ranger and everything, a little, a little bit, bit of storage. Yep, no bunk over the cab on this unit, Andrea. You know that's storage right. Storage there. Yes. And it's weird because usually you see something like a TV there, so I kind of like it that there's not one there. Right, right. This is about this is about the destination. So, um, now in the living room. Beautiful. It has this little footrest, which is a pain in the butt when it is uh when you're in transit okay? but you can put stuff in there yeah for sure uh we do got storage above there okay. very nice cabinetry andrea pretty. very pretty i do see a sound bar there and look look, look at the heavy duty hardware nice. it's just so nice sound bar as andrea was saying is nice Matt. and then oh. look at that so before we show that look at the blinds i How do love you... them okay 
Look at that. Watch I this. love this. So pretty. Watch this, Andrea. Okay. Back up some. Ooh, Look electric. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Are you ready for this? What? Pull these up. Let's say it's bedroom time. Privacy shades. Yes. Oh, wow. Everything is the push of a button. I love it. Don't you love that? And I gotta say, I really like the balances. They're good. really cute. I like the blue in here. And the blue and, and the gray looks good. Yes, and then across on Trey is the theater seats. And here's what I love. Uh, you push this button. What? Oh. Nope, you gotta hold it up. Not a big deal. But you push this button and the TV goes all the way up, okay? Very nice feature. Here's what's even nicer, Andre, if you look underneath here. Oh, show right here. It does have a camera selector. So if you have all the privacy shades blocked out, right? And somebody knocks on your door, you can hit the camera selector and it's gonna show you who's at your front door. Wow. It's very nice. Right on feature. your screen? Yep. Oh, that's cool. Yep, so you don't need to get up, you don't need to answer the door if you don't know who it is. Nice TV. Yeah, very nice. And then across, Andre, is the electric theater seats. You know, very nice push button. They recline, they got little USBs, they got cup holders, they got a little place for a table and they got a little remote holder. I mean, what more do you want from theaters? And seats? Matt, I would assume, uh, I don't know, is this a trifle? Oh, I'm I mean, not sparring now. Because, you know, there is no bunker with the cab, so I just want right, to right. see. Oh, it yeah, is. yeah, definitely. We're gonna show America. I like the colors a lot. You know, you guys, we don't get to see much gray interior, do we? No, no, it's, you know, Fleetwood, Holiday Rambler, American Coach. They definitely do make the best interior color sheets, things. Is it me or is that bed really little? Oh, uh, it's very little. This is a single. Again, Andrea, you gotta understand, it's 600 and some thousand dollars. It's for the non-paying customers. The non-paying customer. <laughs> non-paying customer, as in, here's a place to sleep for the night, but right. you better get a hotel for the next night. Okay. I. That's interesting. Entertain six, dinner for four, sleeps two. <laughs> you know what that's called? What? The American dream. That's right. Very nice. And then Andre, show that cabinetry above. Okay. So again, look at the balances. Very cute. We've got cabinets up here. Over here as well. Plenty of storage. And I like the, um, I'm gonna show this. I do like the slide design in here. Yeah. Um, just really, you know, elegant, not and, over the top. And the flush floor slide. And, you know, there are air conditioners in here, so yes. it's hiding it, perfect. And then right over here, Andrea, we do have more cabinetry, very nice. Very nice. I love the windows right here. Check this out, Andrea. One right there by the TV there and there. Check this out. Oh, cool. It has a tower of power right It's got right two, there. look. It has three, there's a third one Oh down yeah, there. oh so that way if you wanna work right here, you could. Yes, you got storage right there. Okay. A little and bit more storage, storage down there. there. And then you got this table here. This is a very nice solid surface, heavy duty table. And it does come with two more chairs. Yep, and you can so extend it out. Awesome. Well, look how pretty you guys the uh along the slide how they have the crown molding going around it just it looks really pretty yep yep and then this is a look at that uh liberty bridge chassis again uh american coach they built this part and then they get this part and this front part from freightliner okay it's very very nice matt look at that yep and then right here look at this wall is this wall art deco hmm no. Oh, okay. Very nice though. I don't know what it is, but it's nice. You do have a fireplace there. And then this is the kick plate for your Dirt Devil, Dirt Devil Centralized Vacuum. Awesome. Well, Andrea, do you know what time it is? It's, it's now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, burr, burr.
MSRP on this motorhome here is $684,764, Andrea. That is MSRP. Wow. Sale price, you know the sale price, you know, but we can't mention the sale price on the video. But Andrea, here's what I do know. We have a nationwide network of dealerships now that sell this product. So it doesn't matter if you live in Maine, Florida, or California, we will always be able to find the closest American Coach dealership to you, and we will always be able to get you America's best price. And Andrea, if somebody's interested in getting the best price, tell everybody what to do. You can call, you can text, you can email, you can FaceTime. Hey, 301-906-0962. That is my personal cell number, or mattsrvreviews at gmail.com. Send me an email. But the best thing to do, folks, is go to mattsrvreviews.com. Andre and I, we travel a lot and we record a lot. So when you go to mattsrvreviews.com, there's two contact forms. You're ready to buy, click contact number one. We're gonna hook you up with our closest dealership to you for the product that you're looking to buy. If you're not ready to buy and you have questions, click tab number two. That sends an email to both me and Will, and we're here to answer your questions for you. And Andrea, it doesn't matter what tab somebody clicks, it doesn't matter where they live, and it doesn't matter what they want to buy, what's the one thing we'll always get them? The best price in America. Beer, 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 beer. Andrea, let's continue the video. Oh, where do I start? Right there, start right there. Look how pretty this is. It's beautiful. I, I love this countertop. Yes. This is what I wanted for our house. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, check this out. I like that there's adjustable shelves there, very pretty. I see a Tower of Power. Thank you. Yeah, that's another Tower you of Power. Guys, I'm in love with this backsplash. Mm. <laughs> and I see a pull-out peninsula. Yes, ma'am. Yay. Hey, that's a nice pull-out peninsula. We got two drawers, mm. soft clothes. Yes. And, okay, so we got a Samsung convection micro, yeah, oh. convection microwave. Okay, okay. Um, And I think we have a tube burner. Yes. Induction cooktop. Whoa, yes. Heavy, Matt. Come Don't. over on the side. You're good. You're good. We see it. Beautiful. Very nice. Very beautiful. I love this window. Mm-hmm. Very pretty. It just allows in so much natural light. Yes, and I like that. You know, they have the shades. Yes. Okay, we've got a drawer here. Okay. Utensils. Yes, ma'am. And look at this. A dishwasher. Yes, ma'am. Look at that. <laughs> Very, Very nice. nice. I like how it's hiding. Push it in a little more. Okay, we've got cabinets up here. Yes. Okay, we got a farm house style sink. Okay. Pretty, look at that. I like that it's dark. Yes, looks really good. <laughs> yeah, cutting Nice board. big sink too. Yeah, and oh, I love this. Absolutely. <laughs> One thing I really like you guys is check out this refrigerator, how it's dark. Yes. And you know, that way you don't see fingerprints on it and everything. And then look at these things. These things were 3D printed. Yes. See that? Very cool. So it's how you lock your fridge. So we've got handles under here. I yes. love, you know, it just looks really good with the kitchen. It is. Nice size. Now that's also a uh, ice maker and water filtration And then system. we've got the freezer down here. Yep. Good size. Very nice. And we put that back in. Locked. Then again, this all your digital touchpad. Very nice. I like how easy it is. I like how it's, you know, very touch sensitive. Does a good job here. And we got the pantry here. Yes. One of my favorite kinds. Yes, ma'am. Pull out drawers. Very nice. You have two of them, you see? Yes. Very pretty. And then, Andre, we do have a half bath here. Oh, man. It's very small. It is. So you storage come in right here, here, storage and a fuse box. Not really storage. We got medicine cabinet. Yes. Towel holder. Yes. Very pretty with the backsplash. It is. It is very pretty, but as Andre said, it is a little tight in here. Mm. Porcelain. Yeah. Can't do it. I cannot do it. It's definitely doable and acceptable, but I don't like my thigh hitting the thing right there. Not a fan of that, Andrea. Cannot give it the prime poop position. Okay. But don't worry, because I feel like they'll be able to redeem themselves in a minute. 
All right, so coming over here, look at this big walkway right here. Big walkway, yes. And you've got a pocket door. Yes. Over here is the storage, okay? Very nice storage. Wardrobe, got the TV, two drawers there. Hang on. Uh oh. Oh, I. There you go. Wow. Oh, cool. There's, There's a, a safe. safe for you to keep all your monies. Yeah. <laughs> what monies? <laughs> and then we got the wardrobe here. And, then and look at out. this. Nine drawers, all for wow. me. Yes. Yes, exactly. Very pretty, Matt. So the two, the two for me and the other nine for Andrea. <laughs> uh, and then over here, we got the king size bed. It is tilt up. Look over there. We do got the wireless cell Ooh. phone charger, which is nice. I like that electrical outlet, Matt. The headboard is very pretty. I can see it. Yes, and I do like all the pillows. Right here, we do have a CPAP station. You got the plug right there and this to go down. Okay. Very nice. Other side of the storage. Yep. Nice ambiance in here. I love the- uh, And I like the pillows. Fixture over here. Yep, very nice Air fixture. conditioner. Yes, the pillows are very cute. And I like that, you know, look, they have mirrors in here instead of pictures, which makes it kind of look more open and spacious in here when you have mirrors. I'd rather have some Art Deco, but it's okay. <laughs> Going into the master bath, we have a pocket door. Yep. Great Ooh, size shower. Pretty shower. Look I've at that. I've seen tile. bigger, but I've seen yes. these a lot smaller. Great size. Um, nice little place for you to put your soap and stuff. You got your teak seat, plenty of height. Love the size of the shower. This shower is an amazing size. Okay. Over here, we have uh, the medicine cabinet. Yes, ma'am. Very nice. Nice modern style faucet here. Okay. Very cute. And then we have a cabinet under here. Very nice. And then a drawer here. So nice. Oh, I like that. Adjustable shelves. Mm -hmm. Then we've got four drawers. These are so cute. I love handles like that. Yes. Soft clothes. And then. And then again, so behind the toilet, this is shelving, but it's also the emergency exit. Okay. Andrea, I told you they would redeem themselves. This is a prime poop position. Bing! Very nice. Yay! And then and over then here. Samsung stackable. Stackable. Washer and dryer. Stackable washer and dryer. And we have another closet here. Yes. So this is great. Um, there's your two chairs that go to the dining table. Yep. And look, look at this. Oh wow. More more storage back here. Yes, ma'am. Wow. Okay, that's great. Wow, Matt. I think you have to slide it. There you go. Okay, perfect, I love it. Uh, electric flush as well right there. Now, Andrea, that's it, that's the review, that's the American dream. Now, as nice as this motorhome is and as beautiful as it is, it's now time to give you three things we love about it and three things we don't like about it. Andrea, it's gonna be hard. what do we do first? Uh, three things we dislike about it. I have three. You go. You ready for this? Yeah. So I only had two and then I found another one back here. First one, Andrea, look at the door opening, right? Oh yeah. That's it. Very little. This one's a little bit bigger. Right. Oh, that's so true. Hey, it's a $104 <laughs> trash can. I think it's more than that. But. It's a big closet back here right. and you can't get into it. You know what I'm saying? Very true, Like the Matt. door should be. You, Good you, point. I know, I know. Good point. That's number one, dislike. Number two, dislike Andrea was over here. Andrea, did you take your shoes off? I had to, they were hurting my feet. You made me pay all this money for these <laughs> shoes and you're not gonna wear them? I was wearing them. Okay, so number two, Andrea, was the slide out system. Now, hang on a second. I love the slide out system, but when it's up and in, these chairs have to balance and the chairs are a little too wide for it. And so you guys saw that when we were putting the slide out out. So does that, does that make sense? It does. Like, like you, you, see you what wanted I'm it to be a little bit thinner to fit on that. Exactly. Or make that more, the platform more wider. A little bit maybe. Right. Maybe so, another inch. Yeah. Literally like this much Half and it would have been okay. Maybe. So that's number two, and then Andrea. Number third. I have to go. 
Oh, you do have I one. I do. I have to pick at this. Okay. Talk to me. You guys, I am so against this single sofa here. Wow. Okay, um, good. What if, like, it should at least be a full size? It it should have been the and whole thing. Yeah, yeah. I, I just don't get it. I mean, I do like the sofa. It's cute. But, yeah, it's just not practical. Okay, well, I'm going to combo that with the ottoman. When the slide out's in, this ottoman really sucks. Yeah. But that's only when it's in. Exactly. When, when it's out, it's no big deal. Yeah. Great job, Andrea. <laughs> that's three things we don't like about it. Now it's time for three things we love about it. Why don't you go first? I love this kitchen. Burr, 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 burr. I, love, I love it. It's yes. so pretty. I just love all the uh, decor. Yep. It looks great in the, in the functionality, the practicality of this kitchen. Everything just, about it. I love it counter space mm. you got the convection microwave uh. farmhouse sink uh. power, tower of power yes it just looks great that's number one yes number two andrea i'm going to say the feng shui of the color scheme in here. feng shui i like the cabinets i like the handles i even like the dark gray furniture dark gray traditionally doesn't do that well but the way they did it in here is absolutely fantastic. Yes, it looks good with the blue. Exactly. And I am a dark, I, you know me, I love dark gray. Yes, and so I think the color schemes that they used in here was awesome. And I love that feature. That's number two. And then Andrea, I have number three. Are we going outside? Yes, ma'am. Okay, hold on. Oh, you got to get your shoes on. Got to get my shoes back on. Oh, man. What? Something that I didn't touch on. So I'm gonna make this part of the combo. I love the full body paint, here's what I mean. When the slide out's out, you can see that they continue to paint the slide oh, outs. Oh yeah. This is a holiday rambler. And notice how they don't do right. that. You know what I'm saying? But really, it's the Liberty Bridge chassis. It's the paint, the Liberty Bridge chassis, and these nice steps. Yes, these steps are fantastic. They're very nice, heavy duty, and awesome. Look at this. Cool. I love that. And then again, with this Liberty Bridge chassis, it's gonna give you a ton of storage, the most storage on a diesel, and with all those slide out trays, makes it super awesome and nice. Well, Andrea, oh, you wanna go up here? Yeah, I wanna be out of the sun. That's it, that's the review, that's the American dream. Thank you guys, absolutely everybody so much for watching. Again, if you're interested, please call me, text me, send me an email. It's mattsrvreviews at gmail.com or 301-906-0962. But please, the best thing to do is to go to our website, mattsrvreviews.com, and click one of the contact tabs. You're ready to buy. It doesn't matter where you live. We will help get you the best price in America on the American dream. And if you're not ready to buy, click tab number two. Andrea, is there anything you want to say? Yes. Hey, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things you dislike. American Coach will be reading the comments, you guys. And I want to see if you are just as excited as me about this RV. Yes. Uh, thank you so much to RV1 of Fort Myers. Yes. For letting us be here today. Yes. And I hope you guys are all safe and well. Thank you for watching. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll, we'll see, see you next time. time.